Evening everyone, uh, we're enjoying a nice hot chocolate. We're all pretty shattered tonight. We've been in Kota for the day and it hit 40 degrees. So it's been absolutely draining. So we're all really tired. But tonight we've eaten at the dining club, a new restaurant for us. So what do you think, Dave? Well, first of all, let me just say, I think it blew the Voyager out of the water. Um, loved the restaurant, even though it was very similar aesthetic, I think it looked nicer. The food it felt bigger, didn't it? It did feel bigger, like they had more space. Yeah, more but space. That's what bigger means. They had more space. Um, I just think that they designed it better. Um, but for me, the, my food was lush. Yeah, and, it, and again, it, I mean, I know the ship is sort of not been refurbished for some time, but the decor in there yeah. was very nice. Very and of course, the service we had a lovely welcome. Yeah, we did. We had a, a waiter called Jerry who was doing magic tricks. And the reason why I loved that was because it just gave a little bit element of fun and entertainment to the meal. Uh, whereas on the voyage, it was very almost like broomstick up the bum sort of job. <laughs> oh, and can you remember what you had to eat? I can. I started off with the uh, oh God. What's my starter? Help me. Oh, we had the um, figs and. Oh, we did. Oh, yeah. yeah, we had a camembert, camembert. fig. Oh, yeah. don't forget the amuse bouche. Amuse oh, yeah, bouche. We had an amuse bouche of mango and something. Then we had. You say that so much better than me. Amuse bouche. Amuse bouche. Then we had the um, the camembert fig and pumpkin spice, which. I wasn't a fan of at all. I had all mine. But can I just say that my main meal was the um, was the Angus beef something or other, and it came with rib, like a like a is it prime rib, something like that. It came with a petit filet mignon, petit filet mignon, um, and uh, fondant potatoes and something else. And oh my god, it was lush. Yeah, and I, so I had the um, camembert with figs, and I quite enjoyed mine. I thought the biscuit was a little bit too much biscuit, so it was quite dry at the bottom. But I was a bit awkward tonight, because I really mm. wanted the lamb. Just tonight. But it came with ratatouille. Is that right, ratatouille? Mm. Yep. I thought I'd said that wrong then. And what was the veg? Spinach. And I really didn't like ratatouille or spinach, so I asked if the chef would do me the same uh, potato and mixed veg that you had and it was lovely i had my lamb and i really enjoyed it so on to desserts and tonight i had something that blew my mind it was a chocolate fondant um came with a beautiful lemon sort of mousse topping so zesty so rich so indulgent and you had the same didn't you it blew my mind too and it had like massive match makers on top like they were massive um, so yeah, it was great. It was very rich though. So rich. Oh, it was so rich. So rich. Oh, and not to forget that after that we had coffee and petit four, and then also we had a cheese board on top of that. Oh. We, we had liqueur truffles. Yes. And, oh, forgot about the bellini to start with, the peach bellini. Oh, that was, you that was different, wasn't it? So all in all, we had about seven courses. I didn't know what to do with it, but it was lovely. It was lovely. <laughs> So on top of all this, you get given bread and they are constantly coming round with different breads. And with the bread, you get a beautiful lemon and herb butter, um, which is like served to you on like a chilled sort of glass Ooh. plate as such. And then um, they've got three different salts on there. They've got a black volcanic salt, they've got a pink yeah, Himalayan and a smoked sea salt. And they go really, really well with the bread and butter, believe it or not. They are beautiful. The bread and butter was lovely. I didn't actually put any on my food. Did any of you put any on your food? No. no? No, mad. We didn't, but it was there and it was lovely. So overall, what do you think about the dining club? Massive. It was quite up. expensive, wasn't it? It was thirty nine ninety five. I want to say, was that right? I can't remember how much it was. We'll, we'll put about it up. That. We'll put it up. Yeah, we think it's about that. But we had this discussion in there about whether it was worth it. Well, when you think you go to a nice fancy restaurant and have a seven course meal with alcohol, you're probably paying about hundred pound each. So yes, it is definitely worth it. Thumbs up from me. What about you? Definitely a big thumbs up from me. I thought it was a really nice meal. Yeah, and I thought it was worth the money. Service was gorgeous. And it wasn't busy. There weren't many people there. It was about four tables so, all night. So it was really it was just a lovely ambience in there. It was a nice atmosphere. So I enjoyed it and would recommend it. Yeah, definitely. So, gentlemen, let me just quickly ask you, what did you think of tonight's meal? Amazing. Lovely. What did you have? Let's start with Jack. What did you have, Jack? I had the scallops to start with, market scallops as well. Uh, absolutely love those. I love scallops anyway. Um, yeah, it was really, really nice. What about your main? What did you have for your main? I had the duck confit. And I've never had duck as a main meal before, yeah. so I thought I'd try it. And it was beautiful. Oh, nice. It was really crispy, the skin on the duck. 
and the rest of it is beautiful, beautifully presented as well. Really, really nice. Nice stuff. And Mark, what did you have? I have two things that I've never tried before. I had scallops, which I absolutely loved. It wasn't too fishy, it was really nice. You got a nice little salad at the side uh, for the starter. And then for the main course, I had lobster, which is something else I've never tried. And that was absolutely amazing. I absolutely loved that. Mm, yeah, because I've never lobster. It was open as well, wasn't it? Like you still had some shell in there. No, there was only the tail, like the tail as, yeah. a, as, a, as a bit of- Garnish. Um, it wasn't garnish because you don't eat it. It was a, it was a bit of a display you know, tail. Display. It was a display tail. It was a display tail. <laughs> we left it on the plate and sent it back. And then yeah. what did you guys have after that? Well, you had the same list, didn't you? So for my dessert, I had something a bit different as well. So I went for the peach souffle. Mm -hmm. And I've never really had souffle as a dessert before. So that was really delicious. You could taste the peach in it. Mm -hmm. And also had rosemary ice cream. So it was savory ice cream. And it really worked well together. So I really enjoyed the dessert. Nice. Mark? I had the chocolate pistachio malone and it looked like a dome and it had like a, a peach uh, shell on the top of it and it had some kind of, it, it actually looked like a massive, a caterpillar with a massive head on the plate but when you chopped into it, it had peaches inside, it had, um, what's the chocolate thing? Spread, chocolate spread. Oh, Nutella. 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 It's like Nutella at the bottom, um, cream. Lovely, it was delicious. Okay, so, so as the whole meal goes from start to finish, would you rate it? Yes, Definitely. I'll give it a 10 out of 10. Okay, yeah. would, do you think it was good value for money? Definitely. I do, yeah, 100%. And, and I think, Mark, you, we, we found out that you even like grapes dipped in pickle. <laughs> well, yeah, because somebody rolled the grapes in the pickle. I have to say the service was amazing as well, and Jerry yeah, was such an entertaining waiter. Did you we nearly have an accident, Jack? Yes. <laughs> I think we all had a fright for a minute. Scared didn't the life we? out of me. Even it looked like he was going to spill some latte on me. It was an empty cup. Yeah. Like, oh. oh, good stuff. Well, thank you, boys. Um, nice to hear your yeah. review. And so big hit from all of us. Big time. So if you yeah, just keep, keep watching, you'll see how beautiful our meals were. Thank you very much. Thank, thank you. you.